Hello, everyone. This is just... I'm going on stream right now. This is just, uh, you know, if, if anyone was curious how I make the uh, animated videos. Well, not necessarily animated, but the uh, drawn videos that I do. I figured, okay, I'll, I'll live stream putting one together and... Alright, that was weird. Um, yeah, I have two screens, so you're only seeing one of them right now, and I have some other stuff on the other screen. <coughs> but anyway. So, what I have is, I have my script right here. I have the drawings, like I said, they're on another side. And, for example, so I, I set this one up with, okay, so this course is dealing with so, so, psychosexual development, so I'll throw that right there. See my little character, he's looking at it. Figured that was something. And then I'm, I'm going to go through this, read it in my head, and just kind of piece it together as I go. And I'll set everything at the times later. I'm using Windows Windows um, Movie Maker just because I am broke, so. Uh, general stills. Is that children? This is the age where they're putting everything in their mouths. Go back to current video in progress. I mean, you can't see it. Like, this is what I'm talking about. This, and I put it over here. That's how they identify that world. So I don't think so. Do. General stills. And I, I have a large category of just like what I call the general stills, which is like stuff I can include anywhere. And I just kind of try and piece it together where it's like it's not the same over and over and over again. Need to aggressive behaviors later on in life. Okay, so now that I've done that, I'm going to go to this. This is where I keep all my audio. I'm going to take this, line it up right there. How's OBS looking? 30 frames. It doesn't, it doesn't say it's dropped any frames. And now I'm going to hit play and then just kind of sync it up. Okay, so this course of development is called Psychosexual Development. That sounded off. Okay, so this course of development is called Psychosexual Development. To kick things off, we have the oral phase. Set endpoint. This would be around the age zero to one years old. The idea is the id is driving satisfaction towards the mouth of the infant. And as I went over the last video, the id is... This would be around the age zero to one years old. The idea is the id is driving satisfaction towards the mouth of the infant. And as I went over the last video, the id is your primal instinctual drive. This actually makes a degree of sense. Who here has had children? Isn't this the age where they're putting everything in their mouths? This is how infants identify their world. They suck on things, swap. This is how infants identify their world. They and like suck I said, on I things, just kinda... swallow things, eat things. You get the idea. So Freud's theory about this stage breaks up into three distinct possibilities. Where'd that come off at? This stage breaks up into three distinct possibilities. First, if you're force-fed during this time, you'll develop oral fixations later on in life, such as smoking. 
Second, if the subject is deprived of putting stuff in their mouth and satisfying the id, they'll end up with dependency issues. And finally, weaning too early, Freud theorized, leads to aggressive behaviors later on in life. Save movie, hit for computer, and then I just number them one, two, so on and so forth until it's ready to go. Now, uh, kind of the shitty thing about Windows Movie Maker, at least from what I understand about it, I have to... Basically, I have to exit out and start up a new one each time, and then I piece, I piece the scenes together, and then I merge them all into one. So now we're on three... And where's my little thingy at? I'll lower this a little bit just so I... No, actually I want that up there. I'm going to lower this a little bit. Just so it's in a you know, more comfortable position, I guess. Well, stage don't come to the scenes. Okay. And I had this drawn for that. Go to a general still. I had that there. Taking a dump. I just had the picture of poo. And then it's just like kind of generally explaining things. Oh, wait, no. I had something else for this. Boys in the notion, they just want to crap where they feel like it. And like I said, I just kinda I'd kinda try to throw different different general stills up there. One, so I don't have to draw every last sentence or couple of sentences out. And two, you know, Kind of, kind of keep things looking slightly different, making the illusion of motion so that it kind of keeps your attention better. So this is three. Boom. And with the oral stage done, we come to the anal stage. We're going to set endpoint. And I can already see the gears turning in some of your heads. Yes, this stage does involve satisfying an impulse pleasure related to the butthole, but it isn't what you're thinking. And I can already see the gears turning in some of your heads. It is kind of nice to be able to see the uh, peaks and troughs wherever I'm speaking. Yes, this stage does involve satisfying an impulse pleasure related to the butthole, but it isn't what you're thinking. It's taking a dump. What was that? It's taking a dump, which apparently translates to the child aged one to three years. Understanding what they want can be in conflict with the rest of the world. Freud's explanation revolves around potty training and the notion children want to just crap wherever they feel like, But parents want them to go specifically in the toilet, which in Freud's eyes was a microcosm for that individual's interactions with authority. That's... I'm gonna need another one. We'll throw this one out. That said, if parents are... That said, if parents are really strict on potty training, the child will develop obsessive and combative traits, whereas if the parents are too relaxed, it... I'm just gonna tack another one on. 
close it out. Save movie for computer. We name it three. <clears throat> and that's good to go. We don't need to save changes. All right, open up the next one. We'll do a general still. Getting at his kids are learning a mouse and some cities. Throw that one in there. All right, now I need to go to where I. Sh I might. I might be using too many stills for this. I don't like like making the whole video stills, but at the same time, I'm pretty lazy and I don't like to draw. But you know, I draw because it 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 makes it stand out a little bit at least from other videos. Self, that could screw off somewhere. Bam and bam. All right. So this is four. And then same as last time. We just so next at three to six years old, we get the. Guess what the id is satisfying? Oh, undo. Phallic stage. Guess what the id is satisfying here? Alright, so Freud isn't saying six-year-olds like to jack off. What he's getting at is kids this age are learning about certain sensitivities down there and now realize sex differences between boys and girls. This leads to everything from attraction to jealousy in the behaviors of this stage. In in particular, Freud brings up the Oedipus and Electra complexes. I'm sure you've all heard of these before. In boys, the Oedipus complex develops where they get, and again, this is Freud's theory here, sexual desire for the mother. The boy wants mom to himself, and dad can go screw off somewhere. And again, Freud here, the young boy becomes so terrified daddy will figure out his evil little scheme and chop off his pecker. The boy will develop castration anxiety, because aside from mom, the boy loves his penis the most. Yeah, if anybody's in here paying attention to this, Freud was all about sex. Like, sex and cocaine. I can't, like, I, ha I haven't found a whole lot of sources to confirm this, but, like, he loved... He, one of his treatments for female patients was just to sleep with them. You know, from, from what I understand, he did a lot of things that we would consider morally unethical... <laughs> but it's funny because he, he would sleep with his female patients allegedly and allegedly they, they got over whatever their problems were and you gotta remember this is back in like freaking what was it like 40s? No I think it was earlier than the 40s I don't know I'd have to recheck my dates but yeah <clears throat> he loved cocaine and sleeping with his uh, with his patients I mean, he's a smart guy, and his his treatments, you know, apparently worked. 
but he, he was big on narcotics and such. All right. Let me go to my general stills. Probably think large complex is the... Oh, no, no, go back, go back, go back. Not to Freud. Oh, wrong one. Sarah's for earlier when she can't magically. Nope, I'm watching her stills. I like this one. That should be good. And was this five? So you're probably thinking the Electra complex is the same but for girls, right? They love dad, want to get rid of mom, afraid they're gen- No, 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 no. Same but for girls, right? Set the end point there. They love dad, want to get rid of mom, afraid their genitalia are going to be mutilated somehow. Mm. Not to Freud! Well, specifically, it goes away very quickly. Why? Because the girls realize they do not have a penis and therefore wish to be a boy to be more like dad. This is that... Oh. This is that penis envy I was referring to earlier. When she realizes she can't magically change from girl to boy, the urge for a penis is replaced for the urge for a baby. The girl's feelings are now repressed from here on, and they adopt the mother's mannerisms and female gender role. Can't imagine why a feminist psychiatrist didn't like Freud. Save it to the computer, we call it five. Boom. I don't know how to play it. Boom. Don't save changes. We are now... Okay, sweet. I had a special gag I was planning on here, and we'll see how well it works out. Finally, we get a break. Take a brief intermission. All right. Finally, we get a break. From age seven to puberty is the latent stage. Nothing is happening here to shape personality according to Freud. Why? Because they're not trying to fulfill any sexual desire. So, let's take a brief intermission before we get to the final stage. Save movie for computer. There we go. Close. I wanted a, 
wanted to kind of play with this for a little bit. Because I had a gag that I was going to do. And what I found I can do... want it there we go and then yeah she she made some stuff and I, t I told her I would do this Is it under sound effects? Oranges! I like this little doodad. Alright. That should be long enough. Oh, come on! Okay, so that's how I have to do it. All right. I'm still trying to figure out some of the little nuances of Windows Movie Maker. So that's fine. Um, I gotta name it something. Gag latency. <laughs> Breakfast. <clears throat> Breakfast. 
close that. We don't need to save changes. All right, so I'm on the last two. I had some ideas for this one. I just didn't want to draw it out. I was getting I was getting really lazy towards the end of this. Which there's almost no excuse for, because I mean th these aren't very complicated drawings. I'm just I just don't really find it enjoyable to well, not necessarily enjoyable. Like I like putting it all together and I like presenting the video, but like it's so tedious drawing stuff out. Like, I wish I had someone to do it for me. I'll do that. So I don't want to throw in a whole bunch of like memes or anything like that because I it, I feel it would be out of place if I threw in a bunch of memes right now. I could reuse this one, I guess. Might be funny. Do that. that uh, we'll do uh, I need to make some more general stills Leaving latency, we come into the genital stage, which is from puberty to adulthood. This is the final stage, and... This is the final stage, and guess what the id wants? Booty. And surprisingly, besides the latent stage, this has the least amount of stuff going on. Teens just want to go snoo-snoo. That's pretty much it. This is where people start to deal with life hurdles, test their resolve, and find out what they're made of, but according to Freud, it's mostly experimenting like a college girl on Pornhub. Any sort of... I need to... Boop. And... Boop. Any sort of major conflicts in this stage lead to weird kinks and perversions. Freud, everyone! Save movie for the computer. Seven. Close. We don't 
save it. I used to use Sony, what was it, like Sony Movie Vegas Pro thingamajig? That was a really good program. But I had to fuck around with my um, my motherboard fried. I think I mentioned this in one of my one of my little vlogs. Motherboard fried, and I had to kind of star track a computer together from different parts of other computers. So. So to recap, Freud's stages of personality growth and development are known as the psychosexual stages of development. They go in order oral stage, which focuses on oral pleasure, anal stage, which focuses on how awesome it is to poop, phallic stage where boys are scared dad will hack their dick off and girls are brow beaten into accepting they have no penis and thus can never be boys the latency stage where nothing happens sexually and the genital stage and the gen and the genital stage where we start fooling around with our classmates as always i hope you enjoyed the video hope i was able to teach you something and hope you have a good day movie for computer eight. Badoom. And then from here, like I said, we're piecing all the scenes together. So I can get rid of that. I can get rid of that. And current video in progress. General stills. I got this intro vid. One, two, three, four, five, six, I think the gag was right here, seven. Back to general stills, go to outro. Let me say this real fast. Let's take a brief intermission before we get to the final stage. <music> Leaving latency, we come into the- All right, that's what I wanted. And yeah, this is, this is how I do it. It's with w movies, uh, Windows Movie Maker. It's not, I mean, it doesn't have the most features, but I do very basic videos, so it's not, it's it's all I need, I guess. Like, if, if I'm sure there's somebody out there who could edit the crap out of this and make it awesome. But for a personal hobby, you know, this this works out just fine. It's it's a free program. I gotta, I gotta do a lot more playing around with it than I did when I had Sony movie pro vegas whatever it was called but i mean it's it's working out i i want it if i threw in background music i could do that i could just put it right here like i was dragging the um the other stuff come on click the damn thing problem with that is well 
Because I don't monetize anything anymore. I, I shut off all the ads. And where was I going with this? Yeah, I shut off all the ads. And I found some sites where I could get free music. But now it's like I'm going through all of them. And I'm just like, well, I don't know if this really fits with what I'm trying to do, you know? So... Because yeah, that is like the number one criticism of my videos is I need to have some sort of background music. So when I do my next one, which I'm looking to do a Maslow's hierarchy of needs because I really I really like the hierarchy of needs. And um, I you know I'll I'll try and I'll try and find some good background music for that because everything I find it either either doesn't maintain the kind of tempo I want. And it like it it'll start off real soft and you know kind of backgroundy and then it'll turn into like a freaking rock so rock song. And I was like, you don't really, yeah. Anyway, I'm I'm kind of droning on and on, but yeah, this uh, I just figured I'd stream actually putting a video together, you know, just if anyone was interested in how I actually do it. And then we'll, uh, it'll save the movie and then I can upload it to YouTube. Other than that, um, yeah. Hope y'all have a good day. Hope, like, hope this gave you, you guys some ideas. Like, cause again, this is a, this is all free program. I, I all, all that I work with, I do f with free stuff. So, you know, it wouldn't be very hard to, uh, to pick this up on your own. And I will, again, I'll, I'll look into the, uh, background music ish, uh, criticism. Cause that's, I just got to find the right one. You know what I'm saying? And I'm happy to take, uh, I'm happy to take suggestions on which one. But uh, anyway, other than that, hope you all have a good day. I'm, I'm on my day off. I'm going to hit the bank and run some errands.